Linnea gets this under the 18 international series going. Goes high and immediately contested in the sky by the English team and they get position back. I think this Dylan is the challenge that a lot of these coaches have. Solid scrum by England and to the right they come. Looks like Philly's champagne now. Gets it to the outside. <laughs> the worry, he's into space, still going. Still going, he's got Rory, it is Jack Walsh. Who makes a tackle and this could be an insane opening try to the under 18 international series. Just sublime. Brady broke yeah. a couple yeah. of tackles to get there. What was brave about this England team, they uh, obviously went for for the the play and the play obviously worked out but then this man had a lot of defenders around him and he just slide through the defense and the hands off unfortunately for Ireland and Noah Kaluri the right wing of England opens their telly important yeah for Luke McLachlan to find his jumpers which he does in the form of Joe Finn and now Ireland on the front foot and advantage yeah for the Irish team but that's not what they need a try has been scored by Ireland and a great response by Luke McLachlan. to Finn. Strong tackle by the English. Set up now Wood again out the back as the Irish teams do to the captain and now they come to the left and it is Jack Deegan into space. He finds Gibson. Gibson's got one to beat. Will he do it? Yes he does. And that is it. Josh Gibson gets over for the third score and England are in a heap of trouble here. Some great work at the breakdown. That was so important, and it was Tom Davis, the feisty hooker. Oof. And then Sir Tip is the third time we see Linegar take that chance, and this time Ireland awake to it. And Jack Deegan gets over for his second score of the game, and the fourth for Ireland. England, opportunity at bowling the jump of preference. It's Hull that goes up this time. Oli Hull on the front foot are England and they've got the driving ball going and still going an advantage three. for this English team. Still going on the English side and it does look like Tom Davies who goes over for the first score of the second half. For this. A good line throw by Tom Davies and made sure that he's found his jumper. And look at the England back storming forward. They had the advantage and David saw the gap and he went and he got it. And an important try. For England. Cool. Looks like Gibson, the guilty party. Tracy now, the standing captain. We spoke about Billy Hayes almost forcing that turnover. Stuart Harris finds a new man on the field. Inches short here are England. Cool hairs required and quick hands. It's a big man. Or snap breaks the first tackle, gets a long arm over and he scores a try. And it's a very important time and England are certainly back in this game and slow ball here for Ireland Shaughnessy again out the back Maloney the captain into space it's a try scorer goes to the edge and he finds Brian O'Flaherty can he force his way over yes he does his first touch of the ball Brian O'Flaherty trying to get over get the scoreboard replacement captain in, in Tracy working hard to maintain position and is oh. the new man on the field George Newman with a massive show and go scored and uh, really patient play on attack here from England and a little dummy in uh, defense as well you called it Christopher Barrett he finds a big man in Donaha Maguire he's worked hard for Ireland today Barrett waiting for it just digging for it O'Shaughnessy, he finds a man of the match and again he gets on the outside, he gets his hands free, just Dak Deegan and now there's O'Sullivan into space, one to be, gets on the inside and that is a phenomenal way to finish his first encounter try by Conor O'Shaughnessy.